is one of the world's most underdeveloped and most problematic region where there is a lot of terrorism, militancy groups, armed groups that control this area. And this area is called as the Sahel region. Below the Sahara Desert, a continuous band of area which is very underdeveloped is called as the Sahel region. So next we are going to write down the heading Sahel region. We have to take down a map of Africa. You won't see such a region. It's a, it's a political region. So you won't see it in the atlas. Okay. So write down. The Sahel is a region between the Sahara Desert and the Sudanian Savannah. This area is Savannah. We have studied. In Africa, the area faces environmental issues from climate change and where many terrorist groups in the northern Africa operate. Lot of terrorist groups may harm militants operate here. Have you seen that movie Blood Diamonds? Blood Diamond. Something kind of armed groups. You're not going to take that movie. Okay, so this region is called as Sahel. Now, which all countries come under Sahel region? That's important. So see. Now on, keep marking all the countries. Burkina Faso. Can you find out Burkina Faso? Lovely. Next, Cameroon. Then Chad. Gambia. Small country here. Gambia, West Coast. Guinea which gets the name Gulf of Guinea. Mauritania, Mali, Niger, Senegal. These are the countries which we call as the Sahel region. Very underdeveloped, very low human development index, poverty, unemployment, lawlessness, controlled by armed groups. So, United Nations has bought a separate plan to develop this region. Okay, shall I move ahead? And one of the major production of this area is cocoa. The 80 to 90 percent of the world's cocoa. What is cocoa? Which we use to make chocolate comes from this area. And Gulf of Guinea, this is where the zero meridian meets the equator. Can you find out in your atlas? Gulf of Guinea, where you can see the prime meridian meets equator. Sahel region. Now let's write down something more about them. It is vast, semi-arid region, not arid like the desert. It is semi-arid region in Africa. It stretches across the south-central latitudes of Northern Africa between the Atlantic Ocean and the Red Sea. You know the location, you don't have to write this. It has abundant human and natural resources. That's the problem. It has abundant human and natural resources. But the environmental, political and security challenges, there are all the problems, environmental problems, political problems and security problems that affect the prosperity and peace of Sahel. Okay? Done? Now, why was this in news? The United Nations has come up with a unique support plan to target these 10 countries and to help them come out of an accelerated prosperity and sustainable peace in this region. So, unique support plan by the United Nations targeting these 10 nations. That is why this place was in 